In Commitment 2022, seven candidates are running in next month's GOP primary to represent the triad in Congress. And today, our Commitment coverage introduces you to political newcomer Marvin Boguslowski. The new 6th Congressional District now covers all of Guilford, Rockingham, Caswell, and part of Forsyth counties. As WXI 12's Bill O'Neill explains, Boguslowski believes he's the man to get things done in Washington. Marvin Boguslowski says that he hopes to bring the success he's had in the corporate world to Washington. So why? Why are you running for Congress? So two things. One is I'm a single dad and my daughter's in college now, a freshman, so I have some free time available. Free time isn't the only thing that Boguslowski says he has to offer. The Jamestown Republican says that his background in engineering makes him an ideal candidate. But we need more engineers there, people who solve problems. And you know, my specialty is eliminating waste. And if you look at Congress, you know, $30 trillion, we're $30 trillion in debt. Uh, we need some serious waste reduction. Give me some idea of what you could do uh, to save uh, some of that waste in Washington. Got to look at the whole budget, of course. You know, I don't have all the details of the budget, but there's um, fine for they're not adding value to the American citizen. Boguslowski says his training as a Six Sigma Black Belt, a program that helps companies do more with less, helps him to identify waste, and he wants to use that training to cut the budget. And the first option is always creativity over capital. You have to really prove that you need the money to expand uh, the budget in corporate America. So that same mindset needs to be applied to Washington. There is an effort in a number of states to legalize marijuana. I'm wondering if you would support the idea or not of uh, the federal government legalizing it across the country. That's a tough one. I don't have a strong opinion on that right now. I know a lot of people have done it. Republicans are the underdogs in North Carolina's sixth congressional district. The seat is considered a safe one for Democrats. And yes. what makes you think that a Republican can win here, such as yourself? Yeah, so I think the people are tired of the um, political talking points and are looking for solutions, right? We're vastly devoid of solutions from both parties, right? So I know there's a lot of frustration going on right now. Yeah, how do you like your chances in this primary? I feel good that there's some serious, there's some serious competition out there. There's some good candidates. And so basically, I just need to you know, promote my message about uh, you know, why I'm different in terms of the engineering problem solving. Boguslavsky is one of five newcomers in this race. The winner goes on to next fall and take on incumbent Kathy Manning. Bill O'Neill, WXII 12 News.